We want to retrieve the quantity sold for each of these products across two stores. And to do this, we're going to use XLOOKUP. First, the lookup value, that's these values here, inside the same table where we're writing the formula. Next, the lookup array. This is the column in the other table we'll cross-reference with. Then the return array. That's the column in the other table where we're borrowing values from. And finally, the if not found argument. Here we'll return a zero if there's no match for the product ID. I'm going to do the exact same steps for store two, looking up these product IDs in this column, pulling values from here, and again returning zero if there's no match. Now here's the cool part. Once that's done, all I need to do is select these cells and add up the rows with all equals, and boom, I get the total sales across both stores instantly. Don't forget, drop a comment if you want me to share more XLOOKUP tricks that'll save you hours.